What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back, and guys, the support has been unreal. Like I said, usually, I always say it. Drop 10k in the comments as usual for a chance at 10k. Video, just guys, hit the like button, you know. Hit the like button, subscribe, and you know what? This video is fire. And all you newcomers, my stubs are up as usual. Follow my methods, but guys, real talk, the market's about to crash, okay? You guys need to prepare. I'm prepared. I sold a lot of my cards. I'm super prepared for this market crash out of, what is it, 3, three Eastern? I'm posting right before it. Guys, you got to follow this. I'm going to show you all the best players to pick up. Once again, I'm going to show you again how to prepare for this huge market crash coming. Okay? You guys need to be prepared for this. This is going to help you a lot. You're going to make stubs if you just listen to what I'm going to say. Okay? So what you want to do right now, all the players are going up who everyone thinks are going to be diamonds. So if you don't have these players, do not buy them. Okay? And I'm going to tell you why do not buy them. Because if you buy them and they turn diamond or they don't turn diamond, either way, you're going to lose stubs. If they turn diamond, you might make a little bit of stubs, not a lot. And I'm going to tell you why. Okay. So Okuno, for instance, Okuno was about 7K last week or even earlier in the week. 8K, 7K earlier in the week. Everyone about this roster update, he went up in price so much. So I'm going to just show you what I'm saying. Let me just get to him. And Snell, I'm gonna show you Snell as well. Okay, so Okuna's at 14k. Ready? Okay, so he's at 14k. He's at 14k. If he turns a diamond, there is no way he's gonna go up that much more. Because I'm gonna show you, 85 overall diamond hitter, JD Martinez. Let's see, Rendon is 20k, guys. He's only 20k. It's a, it's a diamond. He's probably gonna go up an overall too. 80, 28k. He's not gonna go up that much, guys. And I'm gonna tell you also why because. There's so many kids in the game right now with duplicate Okunas. So, yes, he's probably going to come a diamond, but what happens if he doesn't? You're going to lose stubs. If he does, you're going to make some stubs, but you can't buy him at this price. It's not a good time to buy him. Because when he becomes a diamond, kids are going to rush. They're going to all sprint to the auction, and they're going to try selling them. There's going to be like 500 Okunas posted at once right when that, that uh, update hits. So, guys, you have to... You just don't have to buy him. Like, you could if you want. It's a little risky right now. You had to buy him earlier in the week. I made a video earlier in the week for a reason. So, you could buy Blake Snell. Blake Snell is still kind of cheap. I really believe he's going to be, be a diamond. He's unbelievable right now. Where is the man? He's pretty cheap still. 6K. I might pick up a couple more. He's definitely going to be a diamond. But Okuna is not a good card to buy. I'm telling you. He's going to be spammed when he's a diamond. He's going to be a diamond. He's, he's amazing right now. But I'm going to keep going through on what you guys should buy right now and how you should prepare. So, number one rule right now. You guys have to sell your team right now. Because the market's going to die. Every single card in the game is going to be posted a million times. I'm not kidding. It's going to be all bad. If you have a team, your team's going to drop so much. Another card, Bellinger, I would not buy. Only if you had him earlier in the week, I would stay and keep him. He's going to be a diamond too. Yelich is another good. Yelich is a crazy example. Because if you have enough stubs to buy him, I would not buy him. It's just not a good idea. Christian Yelich. Okay. Okay. Let me show you. Where the hell is he? Is he down? There he is. Okay. He's 66K. He was 45K about four days ago. He was 45K. Sell him now if you have this card. There's no way in hell he's going to go up more. I doubt it. I literally doubt it. Even if he goes up more, I would not drop 66k. It's a huge risk. It's so no. Just no. I'm telling you guys, do not. I'm telling you, I'm right. Guys, let's keep going. So some players are gonna get upgraded. I'm gonna go over golds and silvers, all that. Alright. Whit Merrifield might get upgraded a little bit. He's doing really good right now. Let me go. Okay, let's keep going. I already made a video sort of on this, but I'm going to keep going over it because I'm dropping this at 12. I'm dropping this at 12, three hours before it drops. So you guys need to watch this right before 12. It'll help you so much, man. So let's keep going. I'm going to show you what cards are going to go up, what cards are going to possibly go down. One possibility of going down is Sale, Chris Sale. And I have my team. I pray to God he does not go down overall. That would freaking suck. I have him on my team. I hope he doesn't. So, let's keep going. Matt Carpenter, potential go up. Mitch Hanniger. Okay. 
I do. There's no way he doesn't go up. And I'm going to tell you why. I'm going to go over to Fantasy Foot Baseball right now. Mitch Hanniger, okay? Mitch Hanniger is rank freaking six. And you know what I'm about to do? I'm about to buy 500 of these. Because Mitch freaking Hanniger is the most underrated player in the league. And he's not even going up in overall. What is going on? Another card that's going to be a gold, Barreos. Jose Barreos, guys. Let me get to him. I posted three on him. Let's keep going. We got Yasmani Grandal also might go up. He's on a tear. Don't ask me how. Jose Barreos, guys. He's literally on pace to win a Cy Young. I mean, it's really early, but this guy, whoo, this guy, if you have him, if you had him, I wish I picked up more. He's going to be a gold. Easily going to be a gold. He's pitching phenomenal. Let's keep going, though. All right, let's see. Who else we got over here? Uh, Lester, no. Reese Hoskins is a possibility. There's a lot of players. Wait till I get to the bronze. I have a lot of bronze cards. You know what? Kenta Mayetta did pretty good. He's not doing that bad. Uh, Hosmer, no, no, no. Brandon Bell's doing eh. Nishek, hold up. Okay, one bronze that I want to show you is right now Pete Alonso and Vogelback. Okay. Vogelback is up a little bit. He's definitely going to go up in overall. Probably do a 74. He's on a tear. Another one, you guys need to prepare for this market crash. Like I said, sell your team and just listen to these guys that I'm talking about. Because these guys are interesting. You guys are going to need to know these players in the in the freaking, in the whatever it's called, the freaking update. Okay, I'm sorry. All right, Alonso. Pete Alonso, he's down a little bit. I would pick him up. He's on a tear. He's complete power. He's unbelievable. He's going to go up. No way he doesn't go up. No way he doesn't go up. Elvis Andres is another candidate. Guys, he might be having a great bounce back season. I'm so excited. He's awesome. He's a vet. What is he, 30, 33? I don't know. He's 30-something. Elvis Andres is at a K. He's going to be a... Guys, he's going to be a gold. You can already tell off this. You, you know. Everyone knows he's going to be a gold. 100% going to be a gold. No doubt about it. On a tear. But guys, believe me, all these guys I'm showing you are correct. Hold on, let me uh, let me go with my collection because I bought a bunch of players for you. I got I gotta bought a bunch a bunch of freaking players to uh, flip and stuff. Let's keep going. Let's go. Red Sox. No, Chris Sale is a no no. I'm so upset about that. Batances. No. Glaber Torres is another candidate to go up. Okay, and he's not even that expensive. I'll pick him up. I think he's gonna be a gold. Maybe maybe not this update, but definitely next update. He's doing good. I have two Blake Snells. I wish I picked up more. He's going to be a diamond. There's no way he's not a diamond. He's so freaking good. Another good pickup candid. Yandy freaking Diaz. I'm going to pick up a couple of these. Yo, Yandy Diaz is on a tear as well. He's legit. I would pick him up. Oh my God, there's so many. I'm going to keep going. Charlie Morton's another freaking pickup candidate. What is he at? 1,200? I'll pick him up for 1,000. That's not a bad deal. You wouldn't even lose stubs if you pick him up for 1,000. But believe me, guys, these are worth it. Believe me. Oh, where's the Alvarado dude that throws heat? Where is he? There he is. This guy might be a gold too. Oh, he's 2K and a silver. Okay, do not pick up this car. He's too expensive. But man, he is legit, bro. He throws heat, dog. His two seam is crazy. He's amazing. Let's see. Any other pickups? No, I would not. Oh, Freddie Galvis is another one. Freddie Galvis is on a tear. This might be his breakout year. And guys, there's a bunch of other players. I'm going to just go through the bait. Oh my God, how can I forget? Where is he? Where is this man? Where's Tim Anderson? There he is. This guy's going to be a silver. Yeah, you could just tell. He's going to be a silver. His bat flips are beautiful. Guys, all these players I'm showing you, believe me, they're going up in overall. I'm telling you right now. Trevor Bauer might go up. Uh, no one here, no one else. Uh, let's keep going. Miggy, no, no, no one from here. Billy Hamilton. Mendozi might go up. Wit, okay, Wit's probably going to go up. I would say he's going to go up. Wit's on a tear. Jose Barrell's definitely going to go up. Honestly, Williams might go up. Garver, where's Garver? Where is Garver? Is he even in the game? Where the hell is Garver? Do they not have Garver on this team? Did I pass him? There he is. Mitch Garver. He might go up too. And look at that price gap, guys. Whoo! I'm picking up mad to him. 
He might be a silver soon. He's doing unbelievable at catcher. I'm picking up a couple of him. Even all, even if he doesn't go up, guys, look at the price gap. If you're gonna pick up players, at least make up, at least make sure they have a price gap. Let's keep going. No one from here. Nah. Got the Yandy. Uh, Marcus Simeon might go up. Not yet. He's pretty expensive. He might go up. Matt Chapman's another good good one, yo. 2400 He should go up. He's doing pretty good this season. Okay, Max Muncy's doing good, too. I'll pick him up. He's in the Dodgers, though. Mitch Hanniger, definitely going to go up, man. On a complete tear, yo. I'm putting more on him. I got overcut that piece of crap. Okay, so Elvis Andres. Yes, Joey Gallo's doing really good. Maybe he'll become a goal. Maybe he'll get a vision upgrade. He'll actually be usable. Uh, Tuve might go up. I don't know. He's already kind of high overall. We'll see how that plays out. But, guys, honestly, that's all I really got for you. You guys know what I'm saying. If you guys like this video, just drop a like. Sub down below. Your boy Bugs is grinding for you. I'm super excited for this update. Guys, stay tuned for more Fire MLB content. I'll be posting a huge Market Crash video right when it drops too. Hey, yo,